today's life uh, is kind of characterized by a lot of conflict and stress and competition and one of the best ways to understand why it's happening is in fact to understand the limitations of human ego and our ego is so powerful it's like a you know it's like a pair of black goggles which doesn't permit you to see things as they are and one of the best ways to deal with this conflict this competition this stress strife is to remove this ignorance by having a proper understanding of the self and what is that self that self is actually not having so many colors that are attributed to it and as vedanta says that these names and forms are in fact attributions forced attributions when you get rid of these you in fact reach yourself and the best way to realize what we are is to understand that all of us are actually one there's just one unified consciousness the way the sky gets reflected in million small mirrors and each mirror looks like reflecting a different sun we are all reflecting one consciousness and we are appearing as all different from each other and we look at each other as different from each other because we have our own karma our papas our punyas our own sanskaras that explains why we think we are different but that is our swabhava our swarupa is one that is the paramarthika satya that is the ultimate reality premised on that ultimate understanding if we start a journey to deal with differences and conflicts we'll do a much better job and that is going to be the main basis for meaningful cooperative social work see i would say that whether it's you as you or you or me all of us have the potential to do very well as karma yogis we all have the risks of failing in this whole journey of karma yoga by falling victims to game of the ego so the risks and opportunities are there with all of us it's not about cvst or a spiritual organization or a social organization all of us can succeed all of us can fail so we need to recognize the opportunity the trust but we also need to take note of the risks so we minimize our egos and then we can do a wonderful job and i sh- i'm sure uh, you have a great deal of camaraderie and cooperation but i think you can organize more often how to sort of explore that unity because your organization your professional workers you all need rewards you want to move forward but within all that if you keep your eyes settled on that final truth perhaps this apparent differences will well the i would not try to sort of paint the whole canvas with one color there is nothing called the yous because you have bright sensitive morally ethically very very you know appropriate behavior you see in some people maybe majority of people are highly materialistic and consumerist and stuff like that but i see tremendous opportunity with the new generation because they have so much of positive energy you have this platforms which are the media network through which you can quickly reach out to them so what you think is a threat could actually be an opportunity and i think that is the way to start let's always feel positive about it